Hey, it's Candy. Welcome back to my channel. And, you know, I'm in the same outfit I've been in for, like, I don't know, four videos now? Like, girl's been busy today. So, what I want to do, I need to take off these nails. And I want to see if I can do it at home. So, what I want to do is I want to take this manicure off so that I don't have to go back to the salon. I want to give my nails kind of a break. So, I got this kit off of Amazon with soak off and then a cleanser which is also like um like a nail oil and then I also got these they hold your nail and then another kit came with these foils and that's where you're gonna use these two now the soak off says to put it in a bowl put your nails in there let's see Glass, fill a glass bowl with soak off, place fingers in a bowl, and I'll just soak for 15 minutes. I don't want to put my nails in a freaking bowl for 15 minutes. So we're going to try to saturate this pad, put it on the nail, wrap the foil around it, put this holder on, and let it sit for 15 minutes. That's my plan. So, come along with me on this journey. I don't know what that voice was. <laughs> We're only going to do one hand for now because I don't want to be stuck without a finger or without a hand. So, let's get her done. I'm going to put you guys down like this so you can see what's going on. Aha. Ah, that saturated it really well. So we're going to start with the thumb, and we're just going to wrap it, take one of these holders, and we're going to put it on there like that. Now this is going to get, you know, more difficult as we go. So it saturated it. My stomach is growling. I just ate my dinner. Okay, saturation on the nail, wrap it around. Now of course you could do this with just cotton balls, in fact maybe we'll try that on my other hand instead of these foils. This looks silly. <laughs> getting this all over and that's not cool what we do for beauty right right girls and boys all right last one that worked out okay now this finger is I broke it so hopefully this one comes off nicely I don't want it to hurt. All right. That took no time at all. Like, that was super quick. Pardon my runny nose. Okay. So, I've got them on. You should make weak chained. And I'm going to watch some Netflix for like 15 minutes and then we'll come back okay we're back after 15 minutes or so actually a little longer because i didn't end up watching netflix but i watching one of my favorite like scary movies it's um ghost ship just love it all right so let's go down so i can see what's happening oops okay Let's start with the thumb. Ooh, so gross. Ugh. Well, it worked for the polish. Um, mostly. <laughs> it does not appear as if the nail has come off at all. That really sucks. 
because now I'm going to have to try the soaking method. Didn't even really work for the polish. Dang it, man. Well, it did. Okay, can you see that? It did soften it where I can probably chip it off, but what I think I'm gonna do is soak it for a little bit because I don't wanna rip my nail off, my natural nail. Mm, man. At least it smells good. It's not um, super strong like regular nail polish remover. It actually smells like coconut. As you can see, it is, you know, a little bit's coming off. Maybe if I let it soak for a little bit longer. But it doesn't seem like it would break through all of that. Let's make a pile here so I can put it in the garbage. So I've never had these actually taken off at the salon. They've, um, did a fill, but I've never had them taken off. So I don't know how they do it. I would assume that they do a soak off. So, like, it's fascinating, but, like, gross. This tool I really like. It's, it's got, like, a flat scraper here. And then just, like, a flat screwdriver type on the other side. I was, I've grown up around mechanics. That's what I call things. Screwdriver type thing. Um, anyway, what I was saying was, when you're at the salon and they do a fill, they just take their electric, um, what am I trying to say? Their electric file, file it down, redo the gel, and that's it. They don't soak it off or anything, so. Let's. These will definitely work for the polish, for sure. Uh, let's see what it did for this little broken nail down here. Yeah, it didn't even take all that off. <laughs> this is so gross, but it feels like boogers. We all know what boogers feel like. Don't act like you're so high and mighty that you don't know what boogers feel like. a glass bowl. I wonder what it would do to plastic. I don't know if I want to find out. So I'm going to go get a glass bowl and I'll be right back. Okay, so here's the only glass bowl that I own. <laughs> oh, well, there's four of them, but so you feel like you're going to use so much of this. And I don't think you can reuse it, but I'm going to soak this hand for five to ten minutes. Well, actually, let's just do this one. See how this works. So I'm gonna put my hand in here for 15 minutes, see what happens. Okay, so what I did is this hand's been soaking for 15 and this one for about 10. You can see the residue in the bowl and it's definitely less liquid than it was. So, yeah, let's grab some of these. It's definitely soft. I don't think it's coming off though, like, not how I would expect. It seems just as hard as it was before, you guys. Things are not going my way today. It's definitely peeling layers, like you can definitely see on this one. We're getting layers of the gel off. And this is actually a thin layer of the gel manicure. 
as compared to what I've had in the past. But I don't want to sit with my hands in soak for so long. Like, I feel like it's going to dry out my cuticles and stuff. Ugh. It just feels so yucky. I'm sure someone is going to tell me that I what I've done wrong. But I followed the directions on the kit that I got. Um, so, well, followed the directions the second time. Once we soaked in the bowl. I'm just wondering if I should let it soak for longer. Or if it's because it's actually two or three layers towards the end of my nail because I've had them redone a couple times. I've had them filled. Ugh, so gross. Definitely gonna have to file them. Um, I'm irritated. Can you tell? You guys can't see what this hand is all about. This is my non-dominant hand that I'm using the tool with, so that freaks me out a little bit. You know, this one was in for 15 minutes. Soaked for 15 minutes, so... Actually, more like 17. Dang, dude. It's like, it's disappointing because... I thought this was gonna work. I mean, the reviews on Amazon were good. I will link down below all the stuff that I got. Dang, man. Okay, well, this one is breaking off at the tip. So that's kind of a good thing. Um, perhaps we can peel it. Perhaps that, maybe that's what it's supposed to do. It's just supposed to uh, loosen it and soften it so you can peel it off. Kind of is painful though, a little bit. Um, when this nail went on, there wasn't much nail there because like the pinky before, I had broken it off. All right, the battery is going dead on this, so I'm going to put it on the charger, soak these nails a little longer, and then we'll come back. Okay, I cannot recommend that product or that process. Can you see, this is after picking at them for about 45 minutes and filing them and trimming them down. Look at this one. Yeah. Um, I followed the directions. I did what I was supposed to do, and it did not work. Um, this hand looks even worse. So, I'm going to go ahead and put some nail oil on by Sally Hansen, and I'm going to leave them bare for about a week. And I've been taking a hair skin and nails for a while now probably six or seven months and so my nails have been getting stronger but yeah I'm gonna leave them bare for a little bit so in in videos you'll notice that I don't have my nails done um, I want them to be strong on their own and not with you know artificial gel stuff so that was like a big fail <laughs> Uh, yeah, so that was awesome. Not really. Uh, I'm going to take care of them, though, and, like I said, oil them up. There has to be fails somewhere, right? <laughs> like, everyone has to fail sometimes, and if we don't share our failures, how are we ever going to learn? So, there's my nail fail. I suck. <laughs> I did my best. That's all I can ask. So don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe. I'll see you guys soon. Bye.